Hi, I'm Thomas Jefferson Wedge from Ray White Dalkeith Claremont, and I am in the heart of this beautiful and massive five bedroom home in the heart of Cottesloe, Western Australia. So we're gonna swing around here and see from the entrance, we have an east facing aspect for the home that bays this property with beautiful daylight here. And we've got a gas burning fireplace, very modern and a gorgeous aesthetic as we wrap around to the dining area and kitchen. We've got tavertine tile floors, ducted reverse cycle AC, and in here is where, looking straight east, you're going to have a beautiful view over one of those typical Norfolk pines that we see here in Cottesloe. They're just uh, so awesome to see. And with this, you've got this large breakfast bar slash preparation um, countertop. And here, notice this is where you can have at least five, if not six people sitting. Or if you've got a dinner party and you want to be cooking and preparing and having a beautiful cheese board, over here, we've got right now an eight person table, but obviously enough space to be even do a 10 or a 12 person that flows back onto the main family living area. Now we'll look upstairs later at a second living area, but this is the heart of the home, okay? And that spills out into this great outdoor area with these fold back concertina doors into the back you know, garden area, this is north facing, so you've got a beautiful north facing aspect light all day long. Mature trees, small living space here. You can, this is a six person set, but you could easily do also an eight person here because you've got a bit more space if you really want that big, large, let's say Christmas lunch uh, space for your family. Okay, over here is the laundry room. We won't go in there now, we'll have a look at it another time. Now, this is the downstairs master which is great if you need um, a downstairs bedroom for let's say guests or mom and dad are coming to visit or even you have a multi-generational family and mom and dad are gonna move in and live here. So right around to this side is the walk-in robes dressing area as well. High ceilings, down lights, You've got, uh, you know, remote, uh, I'm sorry, <laughs> controls here for AC to zone in this room. If you come over onto the south side over here, you've got a very large bathroom flooded with light, obviously privacy windows, but here also with the shower and tub, but it's a small hob. So if you're worried about safety for, you know, mom and dad that need to step over something that's very low. So safety shouldn't be too much of a concern there. Now, what we're gonna do is go upstairs and we're going to see the other four bedrooms come on up here again lots of windows so flooded with light in this home at the top of the stairs you've got this gorgeous and gigantic picture window that looks over your outdoor area mature trees you're looking at the beautiful sunlight dappling through over here we've got linen cabinets laundry chute when I was a kid, I probably would have jumped in there and tried to go down myself, gotten in trouble. <laughs> Come on in here. This is the second master bedroom, east facing as well on this side. Great space, because over here, if you'll zoom over to this, you've got an ensuite upstairs as well. So that's the second ensuite in the bedroom. And then walk-in robes just behind you. There are so many pillows on this bed and I love it. So shout out to my wife. <laughs> Come on through. Here is a second living area. Now, very spacious room. Also, it would be considered the fifth bedroom. However, it is, can be used as an office. The current owners actually have this fantastic sauna in here, which I love. Unfortunately, this will not be staying with the property and I would love it myself, but it's not mine. <laughs> if you come wrap around here. Enough space, obviously, for a king-size bed on either aspect, or use it as they have been as an office and living area. So let's look at the other bedrooms. Right through this hallway here on the left is the bathroom uh, and shower that service these bedrooms. If we come on through here, all bedrooms have the walk-in robes west facing so you've got a nice west facing window here and then east facing that looks over the outdoor living area and walk in so very generous size rooms king size bed right here and across the hall it's another large bedroom with walk-in robes 
west facing, ducted AC again, carpeted bedrooms, which are is very comfortable, obviously. First thing you get out of bed, you want to feel this nice, snuggly, you know, feeling of being on carpet. All right. And now we're going to go downstairs to the basement level where we will be seeing the two car garage, very generous size, but also there's this special room that can be used as either a large storage room, could be turned into a music room, which it has been used before as. There's also understair storage with racking here. They've got a second fridge down here. You can do put some wine behind the stairs, keep it nice and cool. But as you see, if you come out into here, very large space, obviously space for not just two cars, but also if they're very large SUVs, space for anything else, your, you know, your gear, your surfboards, your bikes. And then this is the basement storage room, very large room. You've got all this racking that obviously will remain, uh, as I said, and it's also, they put in some laminate floor on the ground so you can um, keep all of your valuables safe here. Perfect for lock up and leave. If you've got everything, you just want to stick in here and shut the door and you've got your own storage place. All right, we're going to head back upstairs. And again, you come up to this fantastic outdoor area. It'll be such a beautiful space this summer, just before you take a walk down to sunset, down to the beach in Cottesloe. And there we have it. Three Broom Street in Cottesloe, a massive five bedroom home is waiting for you. If you have any questions, please call me at 0416-657-300. My name is Thomas Jefferson Wedge from Ray White Dalkeith Claremont, and it would be a pleasure to serve you.